What's up guys? How you guys doing? This is Ray. I want to do something a little different. I want to create a set of videos. I want to call them tips and tricks and I want to show you things like how to set up the controllers in the back of your monitors, how to set up your interface, show you some shortcuts within Pro Tools, Studio One, Reaper, stuff like that. Today we're going to start off showing you something that I know there are a couple of users out there. I know some that have been using Pro Tools for years and never knew this existed. Let me show you what I'm talking about. Sometimes you might have a lot of plugins and like I said, you need to grab that certain plugin. We're going to go and we're going to find the CLA 2A. So I'm going to hold down control. I'm going to left click the mouse and nothing happened, but check it out. Now it's right here. So let's do another one. So I'm going to open the DBX 160. Same thing. Hold down control, left click the mouse, check it out. So now you have both plugins right there. You don't even have to go searching for them. And if you want to remove them from the favorite list, you can just hold on control, left click the mouse, click the individual plugin and look, it's not there no more. So let's do it again. Hold on control, left click the mouse and now it isn't there. Let's close all of this and let me show you the second way to do this. So if you go to uh, setup, preferences, mixing, over here, you have default EQ and default dynamics. Let's go to EQ and let's select the API 558. And dynamics, let's see if we can find uh, the Avid uh, Pro Compressor. Now I'm gonna press OK. Now check this out. Now they're right here. So you have the API 558 and also you have the Pro Compressor which is pretty cool. So, and any track you go to, they're going to be there. Pretty nice. And if you want to get rid of it, you just go back to preferences and select none. Okay. And there you go. That's it. So there you go, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. Stay tuned. I got a lot more videos like this coming. Subscribe to the channel, leave a thumbs up. And if you have any questions, post in the bottom. Later guys.